Bullying is one of the leading causes that affect young children with long-term mental health effects. Franco Salcedo, resident of Santa Clarita, didn't allow bullying to affect him. Rather, he brings about goodness in other people. Um, as soon as I moved, I definitely stood out. Um, I didn't get along with people, especially since in where I came from, it was a more of like a predominant Hispanic community, and in Castaica, it was more white people. And from there, off the bat, I just didn't blend. So Franco has been bullied from elementary school to freshman year of high school, and with no support, his mindset as a child was affected greatly. Um, oh my God! Well, they would call me a girl because my voice was kind of high pitched, and uh, and I played like jump rope with the girls. So a lot of tormenting was like people calling me gay, even though at the time I would deny it. Like you would think the teachers would defend me and, or in some way talk with the kids about, hey, we shouldn't do that. But no, even the principal and the staff was actually kind of, you know, backing the kids up when it came to all the um, ridicule and taunting that the kids did to me. With no interference of adults stepping in, Franco stayed strong throughout the years. For me specifically, it did interfere with like my self-esteem, um, how I interact with other people, how I interact with my family, how I treat others. Um, definitely, I became reclusive. I Bullying is unwanted, aggressive behavior among school-age children that involves a real or perceived power imbalance. Brooks Gibbs gives a quick view on our generation and why bullying affects us. Uh, hatred has become a form of entertainment. In fact, in, uh, in, in the media, they have a, a phrase that says, if it bleeds, it leads. From this experience, Franco gives advice on dealing with children who are being bullied. My advice for parents would be is to give your children unconditional love. If you know someone who has been affected by bullying, check out bullying.org. I'm Sonia Sema. For the latest, check out cougarnews.com.